welcome back to Resurrection Auto. As you see, standing behind me is this absolute... 1998 Ford Cavalier. We're going to get it to move. Nope, none of that. But it is a 1960 Chevrolet pickup truck. Half ton, uh, as you can hear behind me, we got the racetrack going. I'm going to go get my dirt bike so bad. It's so bad. But anyway, so this truck is one of the 17 or whatever that we bought from this uh, one fella. And uh, you'll see those trucks coming up soon. But we're going to see if we can get this one running. We got it parked up here by the shop. It's been sitting here for a few weeks now. Because we haven't had any time to do anything. And our shop truck caught on fire. And we haven't been able to haul anything else. So anyway, let's get to it and check this thing out. This pickup truck right here. It has a small block of V8. It has rust in all of the places, and it's part of a bush. See the critters? Ate the seats out of her. Manuel, we got key action, so that's cool. And then, boom, a small block. Um, I'm not sure when the last time this thing was run, but uh, if you look closely, it's seized up. Yeah, it's seized up. Now the motor spins. So, I think we're going to be in luck. Um, it looks like somebody, you know, did stuff with this thing, like, not too terribly long ago. Um, it looks like it used to be a uh, three on the tree truck, but then somebody took that trans out, cut a hole in the floor, and put a four-speed manual in it. Um... Yeah, get that off there. Oh. Oh, look nice. at that. Yeah, definitely somebody had this running not, well, probably within the last 10 years, because that's what the guy that we got it from said that it was probably about 10 years since he's driven the truck. And it was sitting in the ground pretty good. So, yeah, but everything's pretty well complete. Gonna, I don't know, try, try and get it running, I guess. Probably. That'd probably be a good start, eh? You want to run it off the pump or you want to bottle feed it? Um, <laughs> I don't really want to deal with this tank, to be honest. Yeah, I really don't either. I mean, we can go grab a, a can and my 12 volt pump put on there. Yeah. Because we this can. One, I, well, this one, guys, it's going to be up for sale. Yeah. Um, well, we can just undo it and then hook sooner. up. Hook up the the pump. Just align the, this pump, and then see if this pump pumps. This is gonna be out for sale a lot sooner rather than later. This is just to see if we can get it to run for you guys. Yeah, this is kind of some fun. Yeah, we're gonna try and get it to run, and then if it runs, we're gonna try to drive it out back where it's gonna sit until we sell it. So, Paul Jordan. Wait, this is fun. I enjoy doing these. You don't? You don't go away. Nobody likes you anymore. Shoo, I, I shoo. enjoy... Shoo, shoo. Nope. We don't want to hear it. Nothing. Yep. Okay, get out. I right. fired. He doesn't get to work on this stuff anymore. Or do videos or anything. So, uh... It's just gonna be me and you guys. Shame, I know. Jordan. Fired? What do you mean I'm fired? <laughs> I'm gonna take this day <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to run in the shop and we're going to grab a few things that we need, like, you know, a battery, uh, some fuel line to hook up to the pump. We need to run out and back and grab our fuel tank out of the uh, temporary shop truck. And... Some sandpaper. Yep, yeah, sandpaper for the points. Oh, well, we probably want some jumper wires, too. Um, for hot. I don't know. What do you think that... I don't know. I think all the wiring's good. Right. It looks like it's all there. I mean, it looks like somebody, you know, expertly fixed whatever is going on in this area. And then, you know, all that stuff looks pretty good. Okay, just shut up and do it then. Oh, okay. Oh, man. There? Check oil. Nope, there's nothing in there. How about in this? Oh, yeah, look at that. We got oil. But what does it taste like? I can taste it. <laughs> 
It actually looks okay. Looks like it's okay-ish oil. Cool. So let's go get things. All right, so Jordan's got a uh, battery. A bat tree. Tree of bats. Cool. Cool. <laughs> battery is actually er, professionally installed. That's the words I was looking for. Expertly executed. You know? Alright, start it. Alright, let's see if it'll crank. Jordan, you wanna run the camera eye? Whoops. Time to set the stand up so we can use both hands. Okay. So. 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 You want to check for spark real quick? You have to stick your finger on the end of the one of the plugs. Plug wires. How about I just do this? Easy. Ready? No. Hold it. And fly. No spark. Sand to points. And sandpaper. You want to grab some sandpaper? Oh, yep. That's it. Let's go. I'll climb into the engine bay. Become one with the truck. Uh, uh, one quart bottle. Has gasoline. What color? Uh, blue, I think, with a yellow top. Cool. Getting close to seeing if she'll start. We got spark now, so that's a good thing, I think. You know, I mean, generally. I'm gonna try and pull this fuel line off of here so we can run it to our can. back in it. Now, will it start? Ready? Ready to try it? I think so. Three, two, one? Yeah, sure. <laughs>
probably gonna have a leak. Yes. freaking sweet here Jordan run run this here camera <coughs> COVID. up in rabies the old no. rabies mobile no sit out here in safety I can't wait for like it to get stuck in gear not stop and just go straight in the side of the Jetta truck How you can move it, you don't even know how to open the door. There is literally this much foam on the floor of this thing. I know, it's because there's none in the seat. around to grab all the stuff out of here but it runs it drives we drove her out back here as a scene i overheated it and uh well overheated it or we got a coolant leak somewhere but i think she got hot but it doesn't matter it didn't run that long to, uh, to do any damage trying to run me over by the way guys Thanks for watching, like, comment, subscribe, tell your friends, show your buddies, all the, uh, all the, you know, typical stuff. And I mean it. Go down there and hit that freaking, uh, subscribe button. You know? I don't know which side it's on. I don't know where it is. It's, it's one of these sides. It's, it's somewhere. It's like this. Yeah, it's so. this. Yeah. Well, the like, the like button too. Yeah, hit that one, but, uh, subscribe. So, oh, that's. It's over. I don't know. It's somewhere too. Yeah. All right. Well, anyway, thanks for watching, guys. See you later.